from Benjamin. Uh, Andrew, I'm 23 and getting married in November. One of the things I'm anxious about is having children in a few years in this horrible culture. Uh, how do I raise my future children to have good values and appreciate good and virtuous art without being completely socially alienated? First of all, never be afraid to have children. Or put it another way, be afraid to have children because they're a tremendous responsibility, then have them. We need more children. More children are like guns. We need a lot of them to stay free. We need people like you to be having children. When you create a family, you are also creating a culture. And if that culture is a joyful culture, obviously it's not always going to be happy because sad things will happen, but if it's a joyful culture, if you are with your wife because you enjoy being married and you and she takes joy in you with all your flaws and you take joy in her with all her flaws and you take joy in your children, then you're going to have this joyful household and the culture that you create in this household is going to have tremendous appeal. It's going to be a, a powerful thing because people are going to, you know, your kids are going to say, hey, you know, that is very cool. If you're saying like, if you're, if all you're saying is no, 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 don't do that. That's evil. That's evil. That's evil. Then, you know, you're not going to be uh, giving them a world of joy of positive influences that is going to battle the culture outside. It's perfectly okay to make your point about the culture outside and even to forbid things, especially the younger children that you don't want them to see. Even homeschooling them, is, is, as far as I'm concerned, uh, it can be a really wise move. But the most important thing you're going to do is pour the love and joy and show them that, the, that the, your way of life is a joyful way of life. And when they look around and see their friends taking drugs and looking like idiots, and when they see them you know, uh, going off and becoming radicalized and being miserable, it's not going to have all that appeal to them. You'll have a lot more strength. Listen, as you go along the way, kids are going to believe all kinds of things. But uh, joy is a powerful weapon. So, you know, when you have those kids, and, and I'm telling you, have kids. They are the, I, I'm, when you have children, the world becomes three-dimensional. When you have children, you suddenly say, oh, I thought I was living in a three-dimensional world, but it was actually an illusion. Now I see the meaning of life. And uh, it, it will teach you as much as it teaches them. But again, that is the way you combat the culture. You combat the culture by creating an internal family cu culture of love and joy.